like to know since we just come back from America, the American equivalent of the news of the world. Here it is, the Midnight Globe. Kenny Rogers on the cover, why he needs two women in his life. But the best bit is on page three. I endured heart surgery without any anaesthetic. Can you see that? The Sunday papers. I was incredibly young, yeah, I was just a little kid. Um, but uh, I, I do know that it started out with this riff, which is like a, just a really standard sort of rhythm and blues riff. I was putting it more on the offbeat, so it has almost more like a ska reggae feel. Like this. And then bass is going. Well, the hardest part for me is the words, always. I'm really more of a music guy than a words guy. I think in the case of this song, it wasn't that big a deal, you know. Um, I, once I got the idea that it could be a song making fun of the Sunday papers, then lots of possibilities, I'm sure, came into my head. You know, I think at the time, I, I very much liked writing songs with a rather sarcastic sort of uh, flavor. British tabloid at the center of a national justice. scandal of abuses None of the Millie Dowler revelations it came to light. From the news of the world in a shock announcement. As a string of other hacking victims emerged. Why have they lied? The news of the That's world the in hacking. As Fritz handling of the scandal. The hacking scandal. And the, the, the newspaper's being wound up with its last edition on Sunday. Well, it's definitely gotten to the point where it's not so funny anymore. <laughs> Let's put it that way. I mean, some of the things they were doing are just horrible. And I have no doubt that it was not necessarily unusual. I don't think it was just a couple of people who went too far. You know, I think it's, uh, it was business as usual. Yeah, British civilization. The thing is, though, sometimes funny. You know, some of the headlines are funny, and you can't help but laugh, even at the same time as you're thinking, God, it's so awful, it's so stupid. You can't help laughing about it. And I think that's in the song as well. well I got nothing against the press. They wouldn't print it if it wasn't true. If you want to know about the gay politician. If you want to know how to be a star. If you want to know about the new sex position. an image that came into my mind of like if if someone just more or less lived on a diet of these kind of papers that they might turn into a complete idiot. I don't think I've ever been a big enough star or sort of icon to be a victim of the tabloids. I just think they're not really interested in me to that extent but that, yeah there were some stuff some things early on you know where they made fun of me in some way or another but I've always been a musician rather than some kind of uh, icon. There's no question. 